now Central Oregon's local alert weather with Katie Suniga. Well, here we are looking at a very different start to two hour morning than we had yesterday. So this is a sunrise or a moonset shot taken from this morning. If you remember yesterday, we had a sunrise shot that had clouds in the sky. And of course it was looking the other direction because we could see the sunrise in it, but very different clouds in the sky yesterday. Just a few tiny clouds here in this shot from this morning. This really is actually a good example of the variable cloud cover that we will be having over the next few days, looking at times when we'll see mostly clear skies to times when we'll continue to have clouds with us. I wanted to take a quick look up at the mountains today, at those ski areas, and I did see quite a few skiers up there earlier today, probably enjoying that new fresh snow that we added yesterday. Here's another thing that's changed for us. Other than the fresh snow for the skiers, we can actually see across the valley out to the mountains now. Earlier, this was actually covered quite a bit more, so things are continually changing changing and evolving for us over the next few days. One of the things that's going to change other than the clouds in the sky each day are going to be our temperatures. We're going to see them very similar tomorrow to what they were today, and I'll show you why in just a moment. And then we do warm up for several days where we'll see our temperatures about 10 degrees warmer than we were today. So here's what's happening. We have this trough that we've been watching that's dropped right on down, just like we were anticipating. It's not moving enough between today and tomorrow to change things for us very much. But then as we get into Thursday, we do start to see it slide over over a bit more. This is when our temperatures actually warm up several degrees and we keep those warmer temperatures all the way into Saturday. As far as how those changes look on your local alert future track, still seeing a slight chance for some snow tomorrow off to the east and then a few showers possibly there along the Cascades, but still expecting that to not be much if at all and that should clear up by the time we get into the afternoon for those of us that may see it. This is on Wednesday tomorrow. Then we have these mostly clear skies, then we have partly cloudy skies, then we go back to mostly clear. There's that variable cloud cover we were talking about. That takes us all the way into the weekend where our temperatures are up in the 50s and then Sunday we drop. So take a look at where we are right now. Should be very close to this tomorrow. Overnight tonight we see that change, a nice drop, very stable temperatures all the way through till those early morning hours when we should see just about average, very similar again to last night. Here tomorrow's temperatures, just like today, mid upper 40s to low 50s. Then the change happens for us once we get to Thursday. That's when we see things start to warm up. We're warm Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Cold front comes in on Sunday. Right now we're looking at a 40% chance for some snow and some rain for the lower elevations. And then we go into the week just below average in the mid 40s.